media mod on this camera because my other adapter went bad and uh, it's a lot harder to turn on with these gloves on with that media mod on it. The road has got uh, quite a bit better so far. Going a little faster. To the uh, Betna Guy Trail. I have hiked the Betna Guy Trail many, many times, just like the Pinoti. I used to hike it at least once a year. And the Pinoti opened up and I started hiking it. But I haven't been on the Bet Magai since they opened it up, up through the Smokies. It's been a while. So I'm going to have to go back and do that part. Probably soon. always so much you want to do when you retire, but life just still keeps getting in the way. Oh, that'd be a great little place to camp. Hey there. They probably couldn't even hear me. I've got this modular helmet on because of the cold weather and the vents are all closed up on it. I could close my other helmet up. Well, just a little bit I could, but I've got that big area on the front that couldn't be closed up. It's more of a summer helmet, I guess.
some water up ahead on the map. I thought I was right at it. It seems like it's taking forever to get there. Maybe there's a nice picnic area there and I'll have some lunch. So you gotta be a little careful. You don't know what these weeds are hiding in places. go wash out back there. I was looking the other way. Oh, might be a nice place to camp down there, but it's way too early in the day. I'm going to try to uh, go up maybe Lost Creek Campground. Stayed there several times years past. I'm going the right way. Here 
very rocky up in here. And I heard it was. There's a lot of spots like this. those colors. Big old drop off down there. This is my uh, maiden voyage for moto camp. It's the first time I've camped off the motorcycle in my life. is a little heavier because of uh, winter gear. It's 
probably going to get cold in these mountains tonight, but not nearly as cold as it did last night, I don't think. Hey, squirrel. got fourth gear a couple of times. <laughs> Since I got in the Cahutas, I've been on like 99.9% dirt, dirt road. Cameras got turned. Well, well, you get good view anyway. Maybe, maybe you can see that.
got a bee back in there. Almost got a bee. And this road is rocky too, but it is good compared to the other. There's a point there before that other road that I would have said this was a bad road. But now nah, it's a good road. It does have some rocky sections, but it's a good road. Well, can you see that really big horse back there in the mirror? I'll try to turn it around. I got it on the cord. My battery went dead. I went around the corner. All I could see was horse from one side of the road to the other. And, uh, just in time. Now, what he's doing way out here. Yeah, he's still back there. He's probably with a hundred feet of me. The camera, I'm sure, makes it look like he's far off. I'm kind of zipped up so my battery don't fly out. Yep, he's going back down the hill now. I can stand up with that thing like it is. Might help turn the switch on. And kickstand switch. There we go. Okay, bounce over some more rocks. Gets much maintenance. Okay.
Creek Campground. It's my humble abode for the night. Not too many people here. I stayed, uh, well, my wife and I stayed at this exact spot when we had our first Cocker Spaniel named Susie years ago with a camper. And I camped here multiple times. I bent my guy goes very close to here. Actually goes right around the back side over there, I think. It might be right there. Can't remember. I remember it crosses a creek just outside the campground down there. And there it gets some water. <laughs> 